who had a company called Lucifer Publishing, to uh, write out the philosophical underpinnings of the United Nations. She turned it into something called Lucis Trust, which still to this day exists at the United Nations as a meditation room with a big, big black cube in the middle and a thousand points of light coming through the roof. And she wrote the 10 rules for the one world government which still exists at the United Nations today. And they are, okay, take God and prayer out of education. Number two, reduce parental authority over children. Number three, destroy the traditional Christian family structure. Number four, if sex is free, make abortion easy and legal. Five, make divorce easy and legal, free people of the concept of traditional marriage. Six, make homosexuality the alternative lifestyle. Seven, debase art, make it run mad. Eight, use media to promote and change mindset. Nine, create an interfaith movement without God. And ten, get governments to make all these laws and get the churches to endorse them. Um, let's just say the one thing not welcome at the United Nations is God. <laughs>